the uh, sequential number onto a panel layout. So here in the panel layout, as you can see right now, I just positioned my components in the panel layout uh, like everyone else. I just went and uh, placed my components in here. And what I want to do is obviously if I zoom in a little bit, I have here at the top, you can see two circuit breakers, C25, C25, or the C15, C15. I want the same item number. Right now, I'm actually looking at the device tag and also in the displayed uh, tag, I'm actually displaying the tag of the device. But what I could do is, of course, I could actually use the item number that automatically gets numbered in ePlan when you position your items and show that one. A lot of people like to actually show it in a balloon. When you show it in a balloon, what you have to do is basically you have to here use a draw uh, box, text box, as an ellipse. And you have to check all these three items. Size from the project setting, activate leader line, and activate alignment box. What this does, it basically creates a default positioning bubble here in the top corner with the number of the item itself. Now, how do I number these components individually? You select, of course, uh, within your project, you open your 2D panel layout navigator. You have your panel itself. Here I have my 2D panel which contains all the different components. So if you open it, you can see all the different components, the circuit breakers, disconnects, etc., that are positioned. And using the right mouse click, you have the edit legend item. Now the edit legend item, you can edit them individually, one by one, but of course that takes a lot of time. Or you can simply number, and if you say here, number using the same number for identical devices, what this will do is it will actually, for the same part number, it will automatically number the um, item number to be the same. So when you click here on OK, you get the results. Here, um, the numbering is done.